When you think about Jimi Hendrix, what's the first thing that pops up into your mind? Woodstock, Monterey, classic rock, psychedelic rock, the Rolling Stones, the Beatles, London, England, and so forth and so on, hippies. All of these connotations have been strongly associated and heavily marketed concerning the greatest guitarist who ever lived, Jimi Hendrix. But what if I told you that there was a totally different side of Jimi that often gets overlooked, marginalized, and sometimes even downright disrespected. That's where I come in. My name is Corey Washington and I have been studying Jimi Hendrix for almost a quarter of a century. I would have never guessed that a chance encounter with Jimi's music during the height of the NWO's Hollywood Hogan era would lead me on a life-altering journey to discovering that there's more to Jimi Hendrix than meets the eye. As I begin to dig deeper into Jimmy's R&B, soul, and blues roots, my inquisitive mind wanted to know why Jimmy didn't get the proper respect that he deserved in the black community. Why wasn't he played on black radio? Was he a sellout at the height of the black power movement? The more I researched, the more complex the answers became. This research led me to start a blog talk radio show where I would interview people who were impacted by Jimmy. I also would later pen two books on Jimi Hendrix, my first, Nobody Cages Me, and my latest, Jimi Hendrix, Black Legacy, A Dream Deferred. But in order to reach more people and enlighten the public on Jimmy's far-reaching impact and influence on black culture, which includes music, fashion, and even attitude, a proper documentary needs to be made. That's where you come in. Let's pool our resources to produce a high quality, well-researched, and very entertaining documentary that breaches topics that no other Jimi Hendrix documentary has dared to tread. We'll be going on location around the U.S. to interview major players in Jimmy's life, as well as those influenced by him. Places such as Seattle, Washington, New York City, Los Angeles, Minneapolis, Nashville, and many other places like this are ripe with people who are willing, ready, and able to tell their stories about Jimmy. The ultimate goal is to move from the pre-production stage to the production stage, which includes things like gathering the proper audio-visual equipment, also funding for travel, to these various locations where we have to shoot the interviews and get b-roll footage as well as securing clearances for the music photos and videos that will be used in the documentary as well as hiring independent contractors for various tasks if our fundraising goals are met then work will start immediately thereafter for your help we have some valuable perks at varying levels so let's make this essential documentary happen so the world can experience all facets of the musical jewel known as James Marshall Hendrix, AKA Jimmy. And thank you in advance for your time, consideration, and support.